Josh's Order Corner. That's me. Most likely it was last Sunday that we opened up the first record from uh, our order from Pure Noise Records. And there was two in that box. So we opened the one. It was Can't Swim. Uh, this two won't pass. And then the other one that was in there, we're going to talk about today. This is a collection of rarities of B sides and of covers from Hawthorne Heights. Look at that. Look at that. This is called lost frequencies, a play on words from their album, bad frequencies. And this was, let's see here, just a rarities collection that was released, you know, a while back. I don't remember when this was released. Because honestly, when I looked on Wikipedia, it didn't tell me. 2019. Lost Frequencies is a collection of three new songs, reworked versions of songs on its predecessor, Bad Frequencies, and cover songs. It was released November 8th, 2019, through Pure Noise Records. Uh, I wish I would have read that so I could have picked out a maybe a better song for us to listen to from here. Because we're listening to a video that doesn't really have much going on with it. The covers on here are... Uh, Bruce Springsteen, Bush, Weezer, Ramones, Cheap Trick, Billie Eilish, and Casey Musgraves. So that's kind of exciting. And then when uh, The Perfect Way to Fall Apart was on Lost Frequencies, Starlight or Pink Hearts. Those were all on Lost Frequencies. Did any of those have a music video? Let's find out. All right, so there is a music video for Starlighter, so we're going to switch things up a little bit, and we're going to look at that instead of the Pet Cemetery video. The video for Pet Cemetery wasn't really a video, and Starlighter appears to be, so we're going to check that out. This was produced by Hawthorne Heights and Nick Ingram. It was mixed by Cameron Webb. Those names sound familiar. I believe uh, someone who used to work with at Hot Topic is married to Nick Ingram. Uh, 2019 Pure Noise Records. Let's open this up here, see what it looks like. Inside of here, you got the glimpse of the band. I hit my microphone, it's going to sound weird. Across to here. So nice opening there with the lyrics to Hard to Breathe, So Helpless, When Darkness Comes to Light. Uh, songs written by Hawthorne Heights, except No Surrender by Bruce Springsteen, Machine Head by Bush, My Name is Jonas by Weezer, Pet Cemetery by The Ramones, written for Stephen King. Surrender by Cheap Trick, Eight by Billie Eilish, and Butterflies by Casey Musgraves. Uncle Ed, if you're not already gone, you, you can go, buddy. You're not going to like this. Hawthorne Heights is an American rock band from Dayton, Ohio. Now, some of their members originally lived in West Virginia, but I don't think they really talk about that much because West Virginia is for lovers, just doesn't have the same ring as Ohio is for lovers. This is a nice, pretty, translucent blue look at that looks great originally called a day in the life their lineup currently consists of jt woodruff matt ridenauer mark mcmillian chris papadak and they're a great band uh, i can't guarantee that all those names are accurate for the lineup right now because changes happen they're actually getting ready to go on the 20th anniversary tour of their first breakthrough hit the silence in black and white which is a beautiful record they're going to be doing an interesting tour though it's like an acoustic with storytelling and very personal experience so uh we're going to see that in cleveland ohio and i'm looking forward to it it sounds like it's going to be an interesting time Let's see sounds of black and white was released in 2004 if only you were lonely 2006 both of those were hit albums people loved them and from there I, I kind of fell away from a little bit for a while. Fragile Future was released in 2008 through Victory Records, and that was after their guitars had passed away. And it just seemed different. Skeletons I wasn't really a big fan of. But when I put Hawthorne Heights on just random play, uh, just on shuffle, every song I hear there's I love. Uh, Hawthorne Heights was actually the first show I saw after the pandemic. Uh, we went down to an old Burger King in Canton, Ohio, and saw them play with um, Night Beast. And they were fantastic. They were a great, great show. And their singer has such a dry wit about him that he's very entertaining, uh, whether he knows it or not. The Rain Just Follows Me was released in 2021, 2021. And it was a fantastic album. That was a great, great album. 
So they they still got it. Let's go ahead. Like I said, we're not going to listen to Pet Cemetery. We're going to take a listen to Starlight Echo Utah. And this is off of their bad frequencies. So it might be a little bit different on lost frequencies. It said that it reworked the songs a little bit. So just keep that in mind. Let's go ahead and hit play. I spend the summer falling apart. I love his boy. I slept with the lights on in my clothes. I blurred lines like a picture that's overexposed. Saw myself in the mirror and I froze. Why can't we just hold on? Get on and on and on. Are you supposed to the hot and from high school? Just before I was actually graduating high school, so. You're not coming back to me. Your voice rang like an echo in the night. In the sky like a long lost satellite. Don't let these days ever die. Your voice rang like an echo in the night. In the sky like a long lost satellite. The lyrics for this song were inspired by a journey in the mountains of Utah. With Tucker Hype's front man, J.C. Woodruff described as the worst drive of my life. Snow was pouring everywhere. No heat or defrost. I spent the weekend sleeping in my car. Burning bridges I went way too far. I looked death in the eyes and I got too close. I saw the sun rise breaking over the coast. Pushed myself to the limb and it didn't explode. Why can't we just hold on? I would say this is my favorite off the high school, to be honest. But it still has their hit to it. Like it has his theme are always this easy to digest. I would say if you want to check them out, their first album, Talk to Black and White, obviously. And their newest album are just bangers. Let the sky before it got too dark. My heart sank like the sun with its light. Don't let these days ever die. The secret spot where we part, I reveal my scars. Before we drop so fast, we can reach the stars. Your voice rang like an echo in the night. And they're pretty consistent. Like, that kind of like almost awesome, followed by that like upbeat. They do that frequently. Your voice rang like an echo in the night. I was like when music videos were able to align the song with the live footage. All right. So that was Hawthorne Heights, Starlighter. Again, they reworked that song for this album. So it's going to sound different. I'm going to check it out here as soon as I finish this up because I really want to listen to this one. Um, I love Hawthorne Heights. I highly recommend them. Uncle Ed, you're not going to like them. I know that already. But hopefully somebody who hasn't heard them sees this video and falls in love. Until next Sunday when we open up a new record for Vinyl Ventures, I hope you have a great week. I hope you listen to some new tunes. And I hope you treat each other nicely.